officially sick of this fucking shit, guys. I really am. I'm, I'm done fucking with this week. I am fucking just done. I, I really am. I, I can't even tell you how fucking irritated I am with this fucking truck and the, these trailers fucking this week. This is such bullshit, man. Where do I even start? I mean, the night went out fucking perfect. I mean, the night went fine. I mean, I started the night. No problems, no issues whatsoever. Hold up, let me drop you down. I started fucking an hour ago. I started driving fucking an hour ago. Not even that. I mean, I got, I woke up at 1.30, fucking got here at 2. And we're supposed to dock out at 2.30. So, god damn it. Let me take this shit off. Fuck, man. Nothing's just fucking going right anymore. Nothing. Nothing's just fucking working for me. So, let me try to get into it. Fucking... Why is that light so goddamn bright? Fuck, man. So, like I said, I was supposed to dock out at 1 or 2.30 this morning. Fucking, it's 2.58 right now. It's been 20 minutes since I, since I docked out. And I'm fucking on the side of the road again. So I get to the fucking DC and I get up in there. I get my fucking trailer. I get my fucking trailer. And I hook up to it. And I'm fucking losing air pressure inside my fucking lines. Can't figure out why it, what's causing it. So I figure, okay, maybe my brakes are locked up in the fucking trailer. So I go in the back of the trailer, and sure enough, the fucking the tires are fucking dragging. They're they're stuck. So I fucking I spend 20 minutes or 10 minutes trying to fucking. I get here at two o'clock, and I spend 10 minutes trying to fucking get my goddamn top trailer brakes fucking unfrozen and I think I finally fucking got it I thought I finally got my fucking trailer brakes unfrozen they started moving the left hand side I was looking at my left mirror the fucking trailer brakes in the back were all moving everything was going fine and everything I thought appeared everything was going good so I look at my right mirror the outer fucking tires are moving everything's fine but the issue is I'm still losing air pressure, so I'm like, what the fuck's going on? So, I think, okay, well, maybe if I start moving, maybe I'll build up the air pressure, maybe if I dock out, I'll build up the air pressure, get on the fucking highway, and I'll go back up. Because that's usually what happens. What what ends up happening is sometimes I fucking will go and, um, uh, what am I trying to say? Like, I'll start driving and my air pressure will be down to like 90. I'll start driving, get on the interstate and on the highway, go back, build back up to 120 and everything will be fine. So that's what I do. I get get my paperwork, I fucking leave, start driving. Well, I get a mile and a half down the road where I'm at fucking right now and my air pressure still, it keeps going down, down, down. Finally it gets to fucking 60, the alarm starts going off and I'm like, fuck. So I pull over, I see what the fuck's going on, I get out, I fucking set my brakes, I ended up set, I set my trailer brakes, and I release my tractor brakes, and if I go in the back, sure enough, I'm losing fucking air pressure in my goddamn lines, and don't know what the fuck's happening, Can't, I think it's the fucking seal inside, the little rubber seal inside the fucking trailer, um, in the, where the airlines go, and I fucking think that has to be replaced. So I go to the back of the goddamn trailer, and sure enough, sure fucking enough, the fucking inner out, the inner fucking rear tire is fucking still frozen up and dragging and burning up my fucking brakes. So now I'm sitting here fucking 20 minutes after I dock out, two, fucking 3 o'clock in the morning. Less than, I've gone less than fucking 5, 6 miles, and I'm fucking on the side of the road waiting for a fucking road, rep, road call to come out to fix my goddamn shit. It's, it's, I'm fucking sick of this day. Two fucking service calls in a week. It's stupid. This is fucking asinine. I mean, the trailer, the truck and trailer were moving fucking fine. They were, they were going along, everything was going good. I didn't think I was dragging anything. I mean, you couldn't feel it. There's no way you could fucking feel it. But 
obviously I was, so I fucking go in the back, and sure enough, my brakes are fucking smoking this fuck, and my inner t t the inner fucking tire is blocked up because the fucking air the air air pressure is not going through. I am so fucking done with it this week. It is Saturday. I'm not even supposed to be fucking working right now. No, but I have to fucking work because they needed me to come in. Mm. Fucking got called in twice this goddamn week. It's stupid, man. It's just stupid. It really is. I'm so fucking sick of this shit. I'm just done with this week. I'm not done with the company. The company's fine. I'm just fucking done with this week. I'm done with the fucking winter. I'm sick of this shit. It fucks up everything, man. It, it, the winter fucking destroys everything. Destroys any good plans that you have. Fucking destroy. It fucking puts you back hours and hours and hours. Just It's just fucking stupid. I don't know, guys. It's fucking dumb. I just want to fucking be home sleeping right now. That's what I should be doing. I should be fucking at home in my bed fucking passed out right now. But no, I gotta fucking come out here at 2.30 in the fucking morning and come and work because jackasses don't know how to fucking do their job. I don't know what they fucking call off and I gotta fucking pick up the goddamn slack because I'm a local driver. So they think they can fucking use me whenever they want to. It's just dumb, guys. It really is. I've gone less than fucking five miles since the DC. I could walk to the fucking DC and be there within an hour before Road Rescue even fucking gets to my trailer. And I gotta go to fucking Woodbury and I So what happens? Woodbury again. Fucking another Woodbury load and this bullshit happens. And now I don't even know if I'm gonna fucking make it there and make it back. I mean, my clock just started. I mean, I got fucking 12 hours and 33 minutes on my fucking clock. So, I have time to fucking get there. You know, it takes three, three, and a, three hours and 45 minute drive to get up there. So, about seven hours in total. So, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. So, I got about five hours of fucking leeway, but still. And that's, like, not stopping at all. Like, I got to piss. I fucking, I'm fucked. It's going to be a long fucking night again. A long goddamn day. Fucking won't get. I ended up the other night. I fucking when I had that Woodbury shit happen to me, but the fucking fuel and all that. I didn't get back until three o'clock in the fucking afternoon, and then I had to be back to work. Fucking ten hours later, like they've been fucking going me back to back to back. Like I haven't had any fucking time to do anything. Like I literally, I'll fucking because the thing about thing about is I live thirty minutes away, so I fucking have to dock out and I have to wake up an hour and a half before my dock out time. So, like, tonight, my dock out time was 2.30, so I had to fucking wake up at 12.30, leave at 1, get here at 1.30, dock out at 2. So, it's, I have to wake up an hour and a half early, so when they fucking say, oh, well, you need to work at 11 o'clock tonight, and I get, or 3. So, no, it was, like, fucking, the last time was, like, 4 in the morning. Fucking, oh, yeah, you gotta work at 4 in the morning. And that gives me, fucking, what, 3 hours to do anything? 3 fucking hours to do what? get home that leaves me two and a half hours fucking take a shower go to the bathroom takes me another fucking 30 minutes that kills two hours there then what I have to spend time with my fucking family I gotta spend time with Andrew I gotta spend time with Sonya and I gotta still fucking wind down so I can go to sleep so it leaves me two fucking hours to do that and then they expect me to come fucking back here Like, they don't understand the concept of a fucking schedule, or like a consistent schedule. They don't, they don't fucking understand that concept at all. They don't, they don't get fucking routine. They don't understand that word, that the meaning of that word. Like, if they fucking kept me to a consistent schedule every single day, every single week, I would, wouldn't be bitching right now. But... No, they gotta fucking change up my schedule every fucking day. I'll dock out 4 a.m. one day. I'll dock out 1 a.m. the next day. I'll dock out fucking 8 o'clock in the at night the next day. 
fucking 10, 12, 1, 5, whatever the fucking thing is, they change it up every single day. So it's hard to fucking even stay consistent. And it's stupid. I bet you guys are tired of hearing me fucking bitch. I'm done. So, if you did enjoy this video, drop a like down below. I'm gonna fucking sit here and wait a few more hours or whenever the fuck they decide to get their happy ass out here to fucking get me fixed. So, I'll talk to you guys later. Have a nice night. Fucking hope your night's better than mine. Peace out as always. Talk to you later.